A traditional tap is something that we use virtually every day. These kinds of taps are extremely popular. This pair of taps that we've got here is actually a set of kitchen taps, hence they have the long pillar at the back. These two taps are now in the closed position. If I start to open both taps, you'll see that water starts to flow out of one of them. And the more you open the tap, the more water flows out. The water travels up the pipework in the tap, it then goes up the pillar and is stopped there. It is stopped on that seat. On the head gear, you have a washer that is compressed against the seat and that holds back the water. Once you turn the handle, the mechanical advantage of the screw lifts the washer off the seat, allowing the water to flow through. It then flows out of the spout and into the bowl. To close the tap, you turn it in a clockwise direction and that will push the sealing washer down onto the seat. Then any water trapped in there can't go any further. It will be stopped in that position until you open the tap again, which lifts the washer off its seat, allowing the liquid to flow. That is basically how a standard tap works. It is a very simple but effective mechanism.